What's up, y'all? What's up, divas? And what's up, divas? Your girl, April. And today is going to be some inexpensive, regular wigs from sisterwig.com. I was very undecided of which one I wanted to do. One of these wigs I love because I've already done this, like, on my prior channel, which I absolutely love. And this one here I was never scared of, never did the video, um, because I never got the wig. Um, I, I just never wanted the wig. I just, I was like, everybody else is doing a wig. I'm not going to do the wig. I don't care about how popular it is. I'm not going to do it. So, years later, years, years later, I decided to do the video, or the, the wig, rather. So, I have the Sensational Bump co Collection wig, which is the Easy 27, and I got it in the color number two. Now, I did this a while ago, and I love this wig. This one in Fab Fringe is a killer. Like, they are the best ones. I really, really enjoy these wigs, and especially because it's really hot here now, and I know you guys on the East Coast are probably like, please, it is not hot like that here, and I do apologize, but here on the West Coast, in Arizona, it is like 90-something degrees, so yes, all this curliness that I have going on, and trust me, I love this wig. Um, it does get really hot because it's in my face and I do love it because this is like a totally different look for me. Um, this is a unit that I actually made. And um, it's using Isis, um, Isis collection here, which you can probably purchase as well from Sisterwig. If you can't find the Isis brand, they do have very similar hair that you could purchase. And I just made it into a full wig weaving hair. But I do love this, but it is getting very hot. And in the summertime out here, it is a blazer. It gets to be like 120. Okay, so it is only spring now. And like I said, it's like 86, 90 degrees. So I have had a lot of moments where I've been driving and I wanted to take the wig off my head and throw it out the window. And this was last year. So I really don't want to have that reoccurrence this year. So I figured go short and you can just be a whole lot cooler. So I was very undecided, so which one to do. It was either this one tonight or the actual Mommy 2 by Janet Collection. So this is the one in particular that I'm talking about that I've never done. I love the finger waves in it and it's something different. So I guess in a, I got in a color 1B30. We're just going to try this one out tonight and see how it is. It's 100% human hair. They both are, which is a plus. So you don't have to worry about it going bad, getting tangled, ratting up. You can keep these. And I'm not really sure, to be honest, why it's called the Mommy 2. Because it looks just like the Mommy 1. But this was like a huge hit wig. It was like a number one wig. And back then I was like really undecided about short hair. Hmm, is a 1B30. And whew, so I didn't expect the color to look like this. Honestly, I just really didn't for it to look like this. This is totally different, but we're going to try this. We are going to try this out. You know, the color I think is scaring me a little bit, but we're going to try this because maybe a little bit of color is all I need. Because I love finger waves. I used to do these in my hair years ago, like years and years. Just let's say a couple of decades ago, okay? Not even years ago, a couple of decades ago. Whew, because I'm 40, so yeah, probably like um, two and a half decades ago or a little bit more than that but yes she looks gorgeous i think she looks gorgeous with this so let's get this popping and let's see it does come with before we even start it has a comb it has a couple of combs it has two combs in the front and it has a comb in the back and an adjustable strap okay Well, I tell you what, I will be wetting this, this one here.
Okay, y'all, so this is what I did with the mommy wig, the mommy two wig, what have you, 100% Remy human hair. This is what I did. I will tell you guys this, the cap is like really large, like I feel a gapping in my back of my head. So, you know, I had to kind of like pin it down and taper it some. And I do apologize I didn't show you on camera because I was like so stuck on what am I going to do with this wig after wetting it. It didn't come out the way I wanted. So I just stood in my bathroom and used my really tiny flat iron to curl it. And I just said, you know what, when I wear short hair, I really don't like it on my face too much because it just makes my face look kind of weird. So I'm just going to toss it and play with it and that's exactly what I did. I also put the wig on crooked so it's more to the side. Um, that way the hair kind of like evens out my facial frame. But I curled all the hair going in a back motion to kind of give me like, um, I wouldn't say a peacock look but more of a standoffish kind of look like the hair is standing up opposed to it sitting on my face because I really don't like hair when it's on my face so yes this is the mommy wig um i will say i thought the color was going to be like little streaks or strips of the actual 30 but it's it, the way they did the pattern i wasn't like a huge fan of but i like the wig you can change the style i wouldn't wear it actually straight out the pack like i was wanting to do um because it looks like really pretty on her but it didn't give me that look but I love this retro look but like I said you can do different things with it I ended up tapering the sides because um, when my hair is short I do like it to be like I like the sides right here to be kind of like tapered towards my face and I cut cut the sides as well so I'm waiting for the hairspray gel to dry and what I'll do is I'll probably like put a scarf and tie it down right here or I can use a flat iron and hopefully it'll stay flat but yes the hair quality um for the mommy too it's 100% Remy it was a little coarse to me um it wasn't silky straight of course not but it was a little coarse to me which is probably great because it'll hold the curl a lot better it was easy to curl um when it was wet it probably really wasn't that easy to curl but the hair texture is a little coarse but the good thing about it is it's human here so you can actually curl it if you want so this is my way this is the way that I would actually wear this wig because I like short hair but it has to be like a particular style like you know I can't just wear me per se I can't just wear just short 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 hair it has to be really short with some sides and then it looks great to me if it's not it's like here it's not gonna do for me because of my face shape is kind of long so when I do short, it has to be like short like this, like almost kind of like a boy cut. And I'm happy with it like that. I love it when it's short like that. So this is like a really great wig for the summertime um, out here. Ooh, you know, chop. And like I said, it's um, it comes with two combs, three combs in it. The wig size is a little bit big. I'm not really sure what the difference is from one and two or the original. Um, but you know, I never got a chance to try it out, but the wig size is really roomy. So if your head is not the standard, I'm pretty sure this wig is going to fit you because the cap size is a little bit big, but to avoid all those problems of it actually flying off or like moving all around, I would suggest using like some bobby pins in it and you'll be like perfectly fine. Check out sisterwig.com. I did pull out some of my own hair in the front areas just to give it a more natural appearance. Um, and I just brushed over the part a little bit so that way it's not really noticeable. You don't really see it like that. But yeah, so this is the mommy too. You don't need hairspray for the hair to stand up because it actually stands up on its own. So this is kind of like, it reminds me of this hairstyle that Halle Berry had like back in the day, like a long time ago. You know, I wish they would have tapered the lipstick back. that I'm wearing. I love it. It's called Naked by Milani. It's their matte like Naked in their new collection. Check that out as well. Then you can check out my swatch video. But I love this wig, especially with like huge earrings. It's super cute. Super duper cute. So on that note, stay Devo and Devolicious. And I'll be back real soon for some more videos. And I hope you guys have a great night. Bye. Bye.